Yo, what is going on guys? Bobby here and today we're back with another video. So today we are finally done with the gene grind and we can actually play other brawlers. So what we're going to have for you today is triple true gold skins. So what we're going to be doing is going through every single map that's out for 3v3 right now. There are four different modes right now. So we got a ton to play and we're going to try running triple gold skins and seeing if we can win in every single mode. Now the only brawler I have is Piper and the only brawler skin that Toonie has is Shelly. So it's going to be incredibly difficult. But Real Canadian does have them all, so hopefully you can help round out the squad, and hopefully we can go 6-0 because we're going to play two games on some of the maps. So with that being said, let's hop into it, and let's see what we can do. All right, so here we go into the first game. We're going to be going up against a Crow, a Frank, and a Poco. So immediately, our Shelly pick is going to pay off because we do have this Frank over here. I'm going to try and see if I can two-tap this Crow. Poco does body block that shot, so I'm not going to be able to, but we're doing a pretty good job so far. At getting hits now our goal is gonna kind of just to be able to move up okay i wasted my shot over there so i couldn't do anything but luckily we have true gold toonie just popping off my goal was to break grass unfortunately i did kind of just jump up and die so that didn't really work out the best but toonie is saving the squad right now he's popping off really hard we're just gonna walk into this grass here go for the triple tap we're gonna be able to get it auto aim is very op and we don't even have to aim against a frank we can kind of just shoot at it rc going with the super sneak over there as you guys can tell the new guy or the yeah the new gadget for leon the new different ability kind of thing is really good so we have that toonie just chilling in the bush and then bam he gets a shot off he's gonna use his gadget bam he's gonna get another one we're just gonna let toonie play around over here let's get that team wipe toonie bop him bop him oh he's gonna leave him at two health but either way toonie did just pop off over there we got a lot of broken grass so we're gonna try and make a play over here just gonna jump up and down because i don't think this guy can hurt us very much Oh, they're going to try and squeeze a goal in. Luckily, they won't be able to. Toonie's going to get past the ball. I'm going to get past the ball. Let's go for a trick shot because why not on this crow? Going to go for the finesse. We're going to be able to get it. And that is going to be the first game as a W for us. So again, Brawl Ball is probably going to be our best shot at winning because we do have that Shelly and Piper isn't that bad here. But let's hop on into the next game. We're going to play two on this map and let's see what happens. All right, so here we go into our next game. We're going to be going up against Bull, B, and BB. So again, we got super lucky that our Shelly is going to counter them. These guys are spinning. Not sure why. This guy's just going to stand here. Give me a smiley face. So luckily he is trying though don't think this bull is so let's just fast forward into the next game we're gonna just disregard that this game ever happened but we did see rc just missed that wide open net and let's hop into the next brawl ball game this one doesn't count all right so hopping into our third but let's say second game over here we're gonna be going up again against a tank something that toonie does counter so again we got a really lucky matchup a pam and a colt so the colt's a pretty good matchup because i can try and two tap it not saying i will I haven't played Piper too much as of late, but something we're going to do immediately is kind of just break the walls over here so it can be a lot easier for myself and the Shelly. We're going to give Toonie the ball over here, and he's just going to be able to get a really... Oh, he also misses the net. Okay, so that's one missed net for Toonie and one missed net for RC. Oh, and we actually choked the goal. Okay, so a little bit too much fooling around over there, and we are going to choke it. We're going to just use our super over here, clear up some grass a little bit more. And we're just going to stay right beside the ball, try and get our super. Just click that auto aim button at this angle. Should be pretty easy to hit the shots. Toonie's gone all sneak mode. He's probably going to go for a big super. He's going to be able to get it. He's going to get another one maybe. Oh, he's not going to be able to get it. They didn't know which Leon was the real RC. And real RC is able to get the goal over there. So that was kind of funny. Going to go for the two tap on this Colt. Going to be able to get it. Going to be able to hit that Pam. Pam's doing a little bit of spinning. Oh, uh, we got to get a little bit closer just to knock this Primo off the ball. Going to be able to do so. RC is going to try and stay alive. He's not going to be able to. So we're in a pretty bad spot here, actually. We should be able to get this Pam. Nope. Auto aim, don't fail me. Oh, they're going to be able to score. Mr. OK Boomer is going to get that one. I'm pretty sure all three of them have super. So that's, a, oh, I guess two of them. So that's a little bit scary for us, especially since one of them is a Colt and that Primo is the goal scorer with that jump. So let's see what the Primo decides to do. We're able to hit him twice. Going to go for a kill on that Colt. We're going to be able to get it. It was a risky shot because it did get us really low because that Pam. Toonie's going to go for the sneak. Going to bait a super and be able to get the kill. So that's really good value for us. Now we have the ball. We have control. So things are looking pretty good right now. Going to pass the ball forward. Fake RC is going to be able to, you know, just be a fake. Oh, and Toonie's going to get launched up when he's trying to get his super off. Very unfortunate over there. I'm just going to stun that Primo, get the ball off of him. Toonie is being very sneak, but I don't think it's going to end up working out for him over there. This Primo's one shot. We're going to get the kill. We're going to jump on the ball. We're going for the play. We're going to shoot it. And oh, it just stays on the line. No, we almost make a God play, but unfortunate we're unable to do it. So 20 seconds left in the game. This one is getting a little bit difficult here. 
considering the fact the map is opening up and we do have a Shelly. I'm going to pass the ball to Toonie. I'm going to go for the tap over here. Toonie's going to get a kill. We're going to be able to win the game ever so slightly against that team. But we are 2-0 with the true gold skin so far. So let's hop on to gem and let's see what we can do over there. All right, so here we go into our first gem grab game. Now we do have to stay with Piper and Shelly. Now Ems is going to be our mid because the mid is usually kind of different on this map. It's not your usual mid. It's a lot of turrets and stuff. And I'm going to be able to hold left lane really well due to the fact that it's just one long line. So that's what we're going to be going with on this map. So I'm going to be able to help out my teammates over here. I'm going to jump right in the mid and kind of just break all these walls to make it really easy on myself to be able to win lane and stuff like that. And also to help out RC our M's mid. You guys can see how open it is. So it's kind of going to become a snipe fest soon once I'm able to just stand here and go for snipes just freely basically. Um, but Toonie, or not Toonie, sorry, RC is going to get jumped on quite often because of the jump pad on this map and because of the fact that they are running Rosa. Going to go for the two tap over here, going to be able to get it. Hopefully RC can just walk up and get that. He's going to get pulled, but I don't think it's going to end up doing anything. Rosa is going to jump, but we're just going to get that really simple, easy knockback. Going to be able to get that kill, and things are looking pretty good right here. So, oh, it looks like... Toonie's actually running Band-Aid, which is a little bit odd. We don't usually see Band-Aid much anymore. Gonna just get that jump going right there. Gonna be able to hit two shots. Again, trying to get the kill over here. Gonna be able to do so. Toonie's gonna jump in. He's gonna be able to get a kill. I'm gonna try and hit that Tara. Not gonna be able to. I'm expecting that Rosa to jump on us. Gonna go for a jump over here. Gonna be able to hit a ton of the bombs over there and get that kill. And it looks like Gem's actually gonna be way easier than I thought it would. I thought Gem was gonna be much more of a challenge than this but it turns out it's not going to be so we're so far 3-0 on the video let's hop over onto our next gem game and see if we can get that dub all right so here we go into our next game we're going to be basically applying the same strategy now they do have like a mid-range comp this time so it should be perfect for us actually because they don't have too much hp but at the same time they don't have like the range that we have so it should go pretty well so we're going to be on this left side over here we're able to hit one shot out of three which isn't great not terrible i guess uh, but we're gonna lose position here actually so this is really bad because now we have no clue where this M's is gonna just take a random shot oh it's actually gonna hit so we got pretty lucky there we're gonna be able to tie lane which I guess with the position we had isn't too bad but what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna jump over and just get there faster so I can see where the M's is when it enters it's probably right around here somewhere not sure waiting for me to get a little bit closer yep that's what it was doing Going to be able to get the kill over there. So now we have control of our lane. And they do have a gene with pull. So that's kind of scary. But we're just going to go up over here. Try and hit that snipe. We're not going to be able to though, unfortunately. In fact, we're going to go down. But Toonie's going to go for a play. Oh my god, he almost made a god play. But unfortunately, it's not to be as he's going to go down. So it's currently 9 to nothing. Oh my god. So this is really not looking good for us right now. Toonie's going to jump in. Oh, really good play by Toonie actually. I'm going to go in, going to break their walls over here a little bit. Not as much break as I would want, but not bad. We don't have a gem, so we can kind of just go aggro here. But again, their gene has more range than our mid, so it's going to be really tough for RC to pick up gems over here. Going to go for a kill on this M's. If we can get that, it'll make this game a lot easier for us. Uh, going to go for it, going to knock him back. Going to be able to pick up that kill, so I'm going to get some gems. Going to be able to hit a shot on that gene as well, so I do have my jump back now. So things are looking pretty good at this point. Waiting for the M's to enter over here. All right, it looks like it's going to be a Tara now on my lane. Okay, I'm going to miss a bunch of shots over there. Hopefully RC doesn't get pulled right now. We do have a Tara, so we can't just retreat to the back of our base. We have to wait because it has pull. Oh my god, he's still alive. Gonna try. Oh no, we don't have the gems. Oh, this is not very good. Oh no, I jumped by accident. No. Oh, that was a throw. Guys, we threw. Our team... Everyone threw that game. It looks like we're gonna take the L. We're gonna be oh my god hit the M's We're gonna be able to kill the M's, but I think that's all we're gonna be able to do three two one. Oh, oh, we're able to reset. Okay. Okay, not too bad So the Tara is over there just hiding behind the wall um, Come on. We got this Gonna jump back over here. Please don't kill me. Okay. It's gonna kill me. We know where it is Oh my god, we're not gonna be able to do anything. We almost got that reset We only needed one more to tie the game but that's going to be it for Gem. We're going to be handed our first loss on Gem. To be honest, I thought we were going to go undefeated on Gem. But these guys had a really, really good comp. 
So let's hop into our next map, which is going to be Hot Zone, and let's see how we do there. All right, so here we go into our next game, and we're going to be going into Hot Zone. Now, Hot Zone is a mode that I never play because the meta here, I just hate it. It's such a bad meta. It's always just Pams, Tanks, Gales, and it's just so annoying. It's not very fun, but we should be able to do fine. We're just going to try and snipe everyone with our Piper. So we're going to just try and break all the walls over here. No walls will be held by the end of this game. We're going to break absolutely everything. There's going to be absolutely nothing left on their side. That is our strategy going forward over here. So we're going to try and take this out. Oh, how did RC not take that out? Oh my god. Gale's so annoying. Like, there's nothing we can do. I'm literally just spamming the auto aim button. But there's literally nothing we can do. We're breaking all the walls so that Gale can't abuse it. I'm going to try and take out the turret. They're just body blocking. I'm literally hitting every single shot. But they have so much health that there is nothing that I can do about it. Toonie's going to go for a play. I'm going to try and get that kill. We're going to be able to. And I think it's going to end up working out in our favor even though we died. Now again, just going to jump in and continuously just hit shots. Clicking that AA button because that's all we have to do in this mode. So things are looking pretty good. Oh, it's kind of toxic by this Frank. Going to use my knockback uh, gadget. And we're going to be holding pretty good control. So we're winning by about 30% right now. Um, Gale does have super though, which is kind of toxic. Going to push us back literally for no reason. We weren't in the zone. We weren't against the wall. There's absolutely no reason for this Gale to push us back. But he decides to do so anyways. Again, these guys are so big and so chunky and don't juke that we're not even going to aim our shots. Literally just clicking the auto aim button and it doesn't even matter. Toonie's going to be able to get a kill. We're going to get our control back. And with very little time left, it looks like this one might be a win for us. Now, you guys didn't see that shot to a left. Just going to do a little bit of a jump. I meant the right. A little bit of a jump for BM. And we're going to be able to win this game. Now, I'm never going to play Hot Zone. I hate Hot Zone. Such a bad mode. Let's hop on to what I think is going to be our hardest challenge, which is going to be Siege. So, let's hop into it. And let's see if we can somehow sneak out a win in Siege. All right. So, here we go into our last game. Now, we're going to face a, a pretty broken team comp. And keep in mind, we do have a Shelly lane so this is going to be very difficult for us to win i shelly's literally useless in this mode um so me and rc are going to have to definitely pop off this guy's putting up a smiley face is he bming i don't know but we're going to be able to get that kill on him over there going to give him a smiley face in return it looks like toonie did win lane so toonie's just out here being an absolute god we're just going to go right over here oh no that's not going to work out in our favor is it either way we broke the grass which is going to help us with our push as the bot doesn't have to go all the way around, it can just walk straight and it's open fire for me, the Piper, just to stand there and take shots at that safe. So looking pretty decent. No, please stay away. Please, please, Broken Brawler, stay away from me. Going to be able to get the kill. Going to do about 30% damage, which isn't bad for a first push. And now we're just chilling over here. Issue is these guys literally just keep jumping on me and there is nothing that I can do about it. I was waiting for the Gale to jump. It doesn't end up jumping on us, but RC is holding lane pretty well. We have the best Shelly lane in the game, Toonie. Just popping off. We're going to be... Oh, how did that shot miss? This one's going to be tough to get this bot over here, to be honest. It's not looking very good. Going to be able to hit a shot over there. I'm going to try and see if I can like squeak out a lane win over there, but I don't think I'm going to be able to. Now, the difficult part about this comp is definitely going to be trying to defend. So let's see how we can do with that. We do have five bolts in the bank right now. We're going to open that up to help me out a little bit more with sniping RC's lane. But our <laughs> Toonie's just going to super the bot. Um, there's really not much that we can do here. So we're just going to spam some shots. Oh, oh, hopefully that Pam throws. Let's get a snipe on it. There we go. So we're going to be able to take out the Pam, which is huge. We're going to go on this lane over here because it is a spike. And we can two tap a spike. So it is being stalled out a little bit right now. The spike's being kind of a god. Not getting hit by any of my shots. Oh, I'm kind of throwing here. One, two. Oh, no. Gadget, don't hit me. Three. Jump up. Oh, we're able to survive. We jump over that Gale shot. Now it's all about the RNG. Of course, no bolts is spawning on the left side. They're only spawning where they have control. Oh, I'm going to be able to get a kill over there. But oh, no. We're going to lose the game. Oh, that's terrible. I can't believe we lost. We lost. We tied up the bolts just now, but we're still going to lose. Oh, that's so sad. I can't believe that. All that work. They're going to spin on us as they should because clearly they are the superior team. I'm going to jump up. We actually defended so well considering our comp. 
We did such a good job, but we're still going to take the L and that is going to be it for the video. So this is a pretty fun challenge that did incorporate gold skins. So it's kind of like a two in one video, a challenge and a gold skin type of video. And I know you guys were really eager to see triple gold skin. So I had to get a video out there for you guys. But anyways, it's going to be it for today. If you guys enjoyed, which I definitely enjoyed not playing Gene for the first time in 14 days, definitely leave a like and subscribe. But that's going to be it for today. If you guys enjoyed, if you guys enjoyed, obviously do what I just said, but that'll be it. I will see you guys again tomorrow. Peace.